Hello guys, so today is one of those messy hair, don't care kind of days. <laughs> but I wanted to show you what I've been doing with my homemade kombucha. So you know you get these in your starter kit. You usually get um, two of these. So this could be four servings, but this is Ningxia Red. Really, really, really good. High in antioxidants. I think that's why uh, people in China are living to like over 100 years old <laughs> because the Ningxia wolf berries, it's in the goji berry family, but it comes from China. So this is just an amber bottle that I'm recycling or upcycling. So what you can do, you can put it with coconut water. You can drink it straight from the packet. You can put it um, in the freezer and make like a slushy out of it for your kids. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a drop or two of Lime Vitality in there. My, my little nail things are coming off. So that's two drops. So this is 16 ounces. And then I'm going to add my homemade kombucha. Now sometimes I sift it out because there's fruit and all kinds of stuff at the bottom. But I personally don't care um, when there's that, when that gets in there because it's just fermented fruit. And fermented foods are really good for you. So, I don't want a lot of it though. So, nah, who cares? It'll actually help everything kind of meld together. So, I'm gonna fill this up. I'm going to my cousin's house. I'm gonna go see the baby. And I'm going to share this. So, she'll probably be like, what is that? Or she may love it. I don't know. But, so now I've got the Ningxia right in there. And I only did about half a packet, so I'm going to save the rest of it. Actually, Pepper, I'll show you what I do for my dog. Pepper, come here. So he has had some skin issues lately. He's got very sensitive skin. Come here. Come here. <laughs> so I put, I mean, he's like five pounds. So I'll either mix it in with his food or just put it in a little dish. Come here. Do you want to see you on camera? Hold on. Can you hear me? Are you just waking up? Oh, he was taking a nap. So this is Pepper. <laughs> He's got a messy hair day too. So I give him some of the Ninxia Red. He's my little oily puppy and he likes it. <laughs> See him shaking his tail? Yeah. So if you have animals and you're trying to get them used to essential oils, um, you do it kind of like you would with a baby. You put the oils on you and then just hold baby and let baby smell the oils on you. Um, don't just start throwing oils on your pets and babies because then what happens is is they kind of have like an adverse reaction to it. They don't want it. They feel like it's forced on them. You just wake it up. Here. So last time I put this on the floor, I kicked it over and it ended up all over the floor. But so he's not finishing it. So what I'm going to do, let's see if I can bring the camera down here. Well, I'll grab this bowl. So he's got his food in here, so I'm literally just going to put the rest in there. And he will eat this big time. <laughs> he will eat that down. There you go, bud. Mess over here, Pepper. All right, guys, so <laughs> that is it for today. I have so many videos to edit and go through and sometimes you just got to do a video and throw it on there. So that's what I'm going to do with this. Have a good day. Bye.